what we do here is go back, 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 back. What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video, and uh, it's been about a week since I last uploaded, uh, that's kind of the schedule I want to go off uploading every week, just cause of school and all that shit, and I also have a new profile picture made by Isa, I think it's really fucking cool and I'll link her Twitter in the description, but yeah, today I want to talk about copying on YouTube, because I've seen it happening a lot lately, so yeah, let's get right into the video. I'm gay. I'm, 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 So I know this isn't really a original video, but I just wanted to give my two cents on the whole thing. So as you know, people like Pyrocynical and all, all these other commentary channels used to get a lot of shit for making commentary videos because they'd get a bunch of Leafy fans calling them Leafy clones and shit. And it's kind of the same deal with PewDiePie when uh, he started like getting big off gameplays and things. His fans would come over and be like, you know, you're copying PewDiePie and that shit. But you know, both of the fans and that kind of shit have kind of calmed down and have stopped doing that as much. Because, you know, Leafy didn't start the whole commentary genre. You know, he 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 basically popularized it. Because commentary's been going for a long fucking time, you know, in more than just YouTube. But, you know, if you upload a video giving your two cents on a certain situation or topic, and then uh, someone you uh, know or watch uh, uploads a video, you know, maybe an hour or something later, basically, you know, stating all the points you've literally just made, you know, people might get a l you know, you might be a little bit pissed off because you might think they've copied you or something. But, you know, you don't have to go on a whole like rampage or whatever, you know, saying, um, you copied my video or whatever, you know, maybe just ask them or something, uh, where'd you get all those points from or something like that, just so it doesn't cause too much drama. But you know, people nowadays just seem to try and call out people for anything, where it be transition slides, intros, profile pictures, you name it, people are trying to call people out for it. <laughs> Right, so the difference between copying a video is the fact that if you're jumping on like a bandwagon, you know, like the Keemstar exposed videos and all that where everyone is uploading the same thing, or YouTube heroes basically saying, you know, general opinions that, you know, hundreds of thousands of other people have already uploaded videos on, then you can't really call them a copy because you have no idea where on earth they're getting all their ideas from. Because, you know, it's a bandwagon and there's so many opinions and ideas being thrown onto it. And also if it's like a general topic like uh, the video I'm doing right now, then it's also not really copying because you're just giving your opinion on a, a general topic. And I really think the whole leafy clone shit is just fucking stupid because no one is an identical clone of someone. You know, you can make very similar videos or even a similar format, but you're not going to completely clone them or whatever. <laughs> But as you might have known, I've previously made a video on this, and I feel some of the points are pretty shitty, and I just wanted to go over it again. And also, I've seen it happening a lot more recently as well. Like, some of my mates, Fresh and Colonel Sander, uh, recently made a video calling out an art thief who was uh, ripping off their banner designs and uh, impersonating people using their avies and names, and uh, they called him out for it. And you know, I'm pretty sure he stopped. But also, the amount of people just tracing over Lieutenant Corbus's old profile picture is actually insane. They're honestly all just shitty little rip. Offs. And I might have a few pop up on screen, but it's honestly just pretty scummy and it's pretty bloody obvious that you've just traced over it. It's honestly as trending as this fucking water bottle challenge. But you know, the thing I don't have a problem with is if you're using it as like a phone background or a Skype profile picture or a desktop background or something like that. Because you know, it's it's just private and no one, pretty much no one's gonna see it. Whereas if you're using it as your YouTube or your Twitter, you know, someone's paid for it and uh, you've just completely, you know, used it as your own. And you know, the people might get a little bit pissed off with that or something. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I certainly had a lot of fun making it. Leave what you thought in the comments below. And as always, all the credits are in the description. And yeah, I'll see you all next time. Peace.
Language.